I'm sure you have never eaten cassava in this way. First, we're gonna use two large cassavas. Wash them well and very carefully and with a good cutting knife. We're gonna remove the peel from our cassavas, just as I'm doing here. We will cut them in half and then we're going to remove the hard part of the center. Now that we have our cassava well chopped, we will put the pieces in a large pot with plenty of water over high heat for 15 minutes, then cover it. After that time, we drain the water and put our cassava in a bowl or large container. The next thing will be crush it. We're gonna do this with the help of a potato masher or a molcajete. Mash it hard until it looks like a puree. Now let's add one egg, salt, garlic powder, or one crushed garlic clove, two tablespoons of cornstarch, and one tablespoon of butter or margarine. Incorporate everything by hand. Also, did you know that cassava is a rich source of energy for the body? It's recommended for people who do physical activities that leave them exhausted. Since we have our duck ready, we're going to make some big balls. We will also scratch about 3.5 ounces of mozzarella cheese or any cheese you want. Leave me a comment if you like cassava and also if you are enjoying this recipe. In this step, we're going to place a ball and a plastic wrap on a chopping board. And we will put another plastic wrap on top of our balls to be able to crush it and form a pancake. Do it with the help of another board, a plate or a roller. Once our pancake is ready, we are a little mozzarella cheese and we start to roll up to form a patty as you can see I'm doing here. Did you see how it turned it out? By having all our empanadas. Take them to a previously hot pan with enough oil to fry them. Try to have the pan over medium heat and see when they are golden brown on one side and on the other. That's how you know they are done. Another advice is to accompany them with a homemade tomato sauce. Oh my god, just thinking about it makes my mouth watering. And you? Don't forget to like our recipe and follow us. You will receive notifications of more delicious and easy to make recipes. I'll send you a big hug. Until the next recipe, bye!